Hello and welcome to another exciting episode of the 360 Daily Show, where we bring you the latest news in fashion and lifestyle. I'm your host, Adeze Adwaka, and these are the headlines. Omo Omidada plays Wole Shoinka's mother in Fumilayo Ransom Kuti. Molly May Haig summer chic look. And Louise Hamilton showcases his quirky fashion sense. Megan Thee Stallion's hot girl look. And on our trending segment, Omo Omidada plays Wole Shoinka's mother in Fumilayo Ransom Kuti. Nollywood actress Omo Omidada has reflected on her role as Grace Eniola Shoinka, the mother of the Nigerian playwright and novelist Wole Shoinka in the new biopic film Fumilayo Ransom Kuti. Dada discussed her thoughts on the character and the story's significance for a wider audience. She also mentioned how honorable it has been for her to play Shoinka's mother. Dada's portrayal of Shoinka's mother explored her struggle against systemic injustice in more detail. She also portrays the depth of her character, showcasing everything from her constant bravery and courage to her intense love and sacrifice for her family. Dada is known for her versatility and she has established herself as one of the most talented actresses in the Nigerian entertainment industry. She has also featured in The Gods Are Still Not to Blame 2012, The Ghost and the Tout 2018, Sugar 2019, and Tinsel. And on our sports segment, Molly May Haig Summer Chic Look. Molly May Haig looked summer chic as she enjoyed a yacht trip in Ibiza for her sister Zoe's lavish Hindu on Sunday. The Love Island star has jetted off to a luxurious villa on the Belle Island to celebrate Zoe's upcoming wedding. But the group ventured out of their stunning accommodation for a day out at sea over the weekend where they soaked up the sun and enjoyed drinks. For the boat day, Molly May showed off her impeccable sense of style in a plunging black swimsuit and white linen trousers. She wore her long blonde tresses pulled back and donned large stylish shades while soaking up the sun and spotted a bronze makeup look. The group looked like they were having a great time together as they posed for group shots and went swimming, jumping off the side of the lavish yacht. And onto our editorial segment, Louise Hamilton showcases his quirky fashion sense. Louise Hamilton showcased his quirky fashion sense as he walked the paddock at the Italian Grand Prix, burying his chest in the flared jumpsuit. The British world champion debuted yet another out there look at the Autodromo Internazionale Enzo Edino Ferrari Circuit in Imola, Italy on Sunday. The Formula One star looked incredible as he spotted a long line black shoulder padded blazer which had capped sleeves. He paired the blazer with an eccentric black jumpsuit with flared trouser legs and huge white patches on the pockets. The jumpsuit had a plunging neckline, unveiling the sportsman's bare chest as well as cutouts on the side. Lewis completed the look with a pair of rectangular black sunglasses, a silver chain and chunky patterned boots. And on our new collection, Frankie's Bikinis. Mother-daughter duo Mimi and Francesca Alo started out designing bikinis from the Malibu home in 2012. Their Y2K-inspired silhouettes and bold use of color and pattern made the brand an immediate success, going on to collaborate with the likes of Pamela Anderson, Sydney Sweeney and Gigi Hadid. They've recently expanded into ready-to-wear clothing and accessories too, but swimwear remains their number one. Welcome back. I hope you enjoyed watching. And on Spicy or Not, a Megan Thee Stallion's hot girl look. Megan Thee Stallion promoted her ongoing hot girl summer tour by sharing a video on her Instagram account. The 29-year-old rapper was seen while walking through Detroit's Little Caesars Arena as she prepared to take to the stage and perform for her fans. The heat maker showed off wearing a hot pink bikini top which highlighted her toned arms and midsection. She also wore a pair of matching chaps that exposed her sculpted upper thighs and ample derriere. The songwriter's voluminous brunette hair remained free-flowing and contrasted perfectly with the bright tone of her clothing. And don't forget to catch us up at SpiceTV underscore Africa. Until the next episode, do have a lovely time. Bye-bye.